Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Martian Technology here, and today in this video, I would be reviewing you the Euphoria OS for the Google Nexus 5. So, this ROM offers you Android 5.1.1. So, I made a previous video before two months ago on Euphoria OS for Nexus 5, which was Android 5.1, and this is an updated video because this ROM just got updated to Android 5.1.1. So, let's take a look at the features of this ROM. So, I would be linking the download link and the installation video in the description. You can check that out. So you would be getting performance with this ROM. So from this performance, if you have IO scheduler, if you have device control, you would be getting that IO scheduler thing, which is a nice feature then. You would be getting built-in super suit. So from built-in super suit, you can just access root, which is a nice thing. Then you would be getting privacy. So as you can see this privacy option from which you can blacklist anybody you want you can see this blacklist menu you can blacklist and a new unknown people then you get this privacy guard option from which you can privacy guard any application you want then you would be getting notification drawer from notification drawer you can just customize your notification drawer as you can see this section this is called notification drawer so how to customize is here are all the things if you want to change the tiles if you want to add or change it you can just do that from this menu then you can add advanced location settings you can show four tiles per row as you can see that which is a nice feature with this ROM then let's take a look at the another feature we would be getting status bar this is called status bar so from status bar you can just tweak your clock you can get it to right you can get it to center you can add your date and the in am or pm indicator as you can see i did that so you can do that too which is a nice thing you wouldn't be getting this for the stock aosp bomb you would be getting network traffic which is useful for some people who wants to see the background internet usage as you can see there next feature is themes from themes you can just apply many themes and customize your phone uh, you can add any black theme if you don't like this white interface there are a bunch of themes on google play store you can just go for go to google play store and search for theme engine to see all the themes so you would be getting buttons so from this button you can just enable or disable your navigation bar and if you have LMT, this is a nice feature because you can just disable that. You can change its dimensions, you can change its navigation rings, you can customize that and add power button or a screenshot and many other things. You can add power menu from which you can tweak your power menu, you can add screen recorder, screenshot. And these are all the things which is a nice feature. Then you would be getting this wake up device where you can wake up your device from volume button as nexus 5's lock screen this power button is a bit weak you can use that feature which is really helpful then the last uh, is the, the display and lights so display and lights from this corner a uh, section you can screen record your screen just you get a screen recorder option from which yeah you can record the video size you can get it at 720p or if you want 480p you can do that from these dimensions then you get touch control so as you can see if you want double tap to wake or sweep to wake you can just on that from this form then you get LCD density so if you know about these things you can just do that so I prefer to keep it default you can add it to 560, 520 or there are many varieties of this densities and the main thing is lights from lights you can just change your battery light if you your charging light as you can see there so you can change it any color you want and which is a nice thing and you would be getting notification light too so these are all the features of Euphoria OS uh, Android 501.1 for the Nexus 5. So if you like this video, please give a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And as Android M is out, I will be making videos on Android M too. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe.